Hey guys, welcome back to Electrical Car Repair Life. Thank you guys for watching and subscribing to the channel, guys. In today's video, guys, we're going to discuss the difference between burning oil from uh, valve stem seals, valve seals, or piston rings, guys. How to know if you have bad valve seals or bad piston rings? If your car is smoking blue smoke out of the exhaust, guys, it's one of the two, and we'll explain, guys, how to know that. Now, as you can see, that engine is completely apart. This is, guys, because we'll be making more than 200 videos on every car we get at the shop. Our mission is to save you guys as much money as we can. So please, guys, subscribe to the channel and like the video. Hopefully, guys, we can save you some serious money. Now, with engine being taken apart, guys, I can show you what I'm talking about and we'll explain the different symptoms and what you can expect from uh, piston rings and valve stems. So, this is, guys, the engine right here. Four cylinder engine doesn't matter if you have four, six, eight, practically it's the same. You have four pistons on a four cylinder engine, guys. Uh, most of the new ones now have 16 valves, some even have more, really depends. And we're going to start, guys, with explaining a little bit where piston rings are, valve stems, and then we'll get to the symptoms. This is, guys, your cylinder head, and as you know, you have your camshaft right here. This is your camshaft on top of the cylinder head. So. All those bearings, guys, they need lubrication. How they get lubricated? Okay, the oil pump, guys, sprays, okay, sprays oil right here. It sprays quite a bit of oil. And that oil, guys, okay, it's going to lubricate the camshaft. It's going to lubricate valves, guys. It's going to lubricate and bring oil to the hydraulic valve lifters as well that are self-adjustable on most cars. So you need quite a bit of oil pressure here, guys. Now, let's talk about, guys, why you need valve stem seals because otherwise guys okay all that oil from the head will start dripping in your combustion chamber on top of the pistons through the intake valves or uh, the exhaust valves guys it will make its way out uh, uh, through the exhaust it won't burn so much but it will still leak some in the combustion chamber now on each valve stem guys you have a valve seal okay on each valve stem you have a valve seal and that valve seal, seal okay, looks kind of like that. You have different kinds. And that valve seal, guys, it's kind of like a rubber uh, bushing, guys, that scrapes the oil off the valve stem so that oil doesn't leak in the combustion chamber. And those, they do get wear, wear out, they crack, they break when they get old because they, uh, that, that rubber turns into plastic, guys. And you start dripping oil in the combustion chamber, you start burning oil, you know this guy's blue smoke. But we'll explain the difference between the two in just a second. Your rings that we're talking about, here you guys have on each piston, first two rings are known as comp compression rings, the third ring is the oil, oil ring. That's the one that guys, okay, uh, scrapes the oil off of the cylinder wall and brings it to the oil pan. Now, if that ring is wore out, it's going to leave a thin layer of oil that will burn in the combustion chamber and it will go through the exhaust. How you know guys, you're burning oil from valve stem seals or piston rings. Now, valve stem seals, when you let your car sit for a few hours without driving it and you start the car guys, you will notice bluish smoke coming out of the exhaust for the first, first five minutes maybe. Then it will be gone, no smoke. That means you have bad valve stem seals. Also, if you let the car idle, you're at a stoplight, traffic light, something like that now, guys. Let it idle for a while, like a minute, and you give it gas, it's going to smoke for a few seconds, and then the smoke will be gone. This, guys, is valve stem seals because the engine will be at lower RPMs, it will create vacuum, and you will pull oil around the valve stems if the seals are not good. Now, what about uh, piston rings? Piston rings, guys, you're going to smoke all the time. So. The higher the RPMs, the more the smoke usually. But the smoke will not disappear, guys. Once you start your car, it will start, it may smoke a little bit more in the beginning, but after that, you will still be smoking constantly. Maybe a little bit, but it will be noticeable. So you know there, guys, that it's a valve, uh, it's actually a piston rings. Valve stem seals, after you rev your car up a few times, the smoke should be gone. Until you idle again for a long time, or you turn your car off, because when you turn your car off, okay, the oil will start dripping in the cylinders, on top of the pistons and when you start the car okay that oil will mix with fuel it will burn quick and it will clean itself and after that you should notice uh, no bluish smoke so that's how you guys know hopefully the video will be helpful thank you for watching please subscribe to the channel for more videos guys and see you guys next time